But <laughs> Happy Father's Day. Thank you. That's right. That's right. Thank you. I saw a Canadian on the ship. I say, where's my ketchup flavored potato chip? You know that's a Canada exclusive. But you know, my
that are from countries that speak Spanish. So I need to learn how to communicate with them better, right? So I need to learn Spanish. So I've been learning on Duolingo and just practicing. But now what we're going to do is we're going to teach everybody in the room here. How many people here speak Spanish? Zero? Well, by the time you leave here, everyone 100% is going to know one word in Spanish. All right? You're going to leave this little with more knowledge than when you came. All right, so ladies and gentlemen, so... You don't have to know Spanish to sing the song, because we're, we're going to cheat, right? We're going to just sing la, 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 and then the bridge. I know everybody knows that Spanish word, so here we go. One, two, three, two, three, two, three. Thank you. 
that lady gets a free drink right there. She's amazing. She's woo woo woo. Lots of energy. <laughs> Shall we? All yeah, right, folks. Dave, your musical director. Let's hear it for him. Come on. Thank you. And the Adventure of the Seas Orchestra. Come on. They are awesome. You guys are a ton of fun. All right, Dave, you're going to be back. You were surprised at the end, right? Okay, so stay tuned for that. Hello, everyone. Hello. My name is Kabir. I'm your cruise director here aboard the beautiful Adventure of the Seas. Isn't she beautiful, folks? Yeah. Yes, we're so happy to have you back with us. Uh, now, uh, I'm going to get into actually how many of you there are. And first of all, uh, do we have any gold members here? Any gold folks? Make some noise. Make some noise for me. Oh, yes. Good to see you. Good to see you. All right. Do we have any Platinums with us? Platinums, make some noise! Yeah. Welcome, great to see you. Do we have any Emerald members? Emeralds! Yes! <laughs> you get an award, sir. Well done. They gave me a pin. You, got, you want a pin? They gave me one. They gave you a pin. Yeah. I want a pin. I'm just being sad about that. Right. Uh, diamonds! Any diamonds? Okay. Uh, diamond Plus! Oh, we have 25 pinnacles. Any pinnacles here? Yeah. All right in the front. Right? I love it. I love it. Um, well, folks, it's a pleasure to have you back with us. Uh, as I mentioned, my name is Kabir. I'm from Toronto, Canada. I've been to the Royal Caribbean uh, just actually since April, uh, but I've been a cruise director since 2016, and I'm so excited to be here as part of this great company. Now, for so many of us, what we do, especially working on cruise ships, uh, is very much our passion. We love what we do, and we're so happy that each and every one of you has been able to come here and, of course, to keep our Azipod spinning. So thank you very much. And I'd like to now introduce you to some fellow members of my amazing team. Let's welcome them down. Give them a round of applause. Some of our officers here on board. Come on down, folks. Come on down. So I'm going to introduce you to a few of our amazing officers. We have our inventory manager there, Alex. We have our HR manager, Lizelle. It was actually her birthday yesterday. Yes. <laughs> uh, we have our performance director, Ian. Our digital manager, John. Uh, we have our next cruise manager, Christina. Hi. So actually, uh, you have some great promos the first few days of the cruise, right? On top of that, Icon of the Sea, she's available, right? Are you booking? So come and see, come and see Christina at the end. We're going to be standing at the end, uh, at the end of the show as well. Uh, we have Roberto, our chief housekeeper over here. Yes. We have our IT manager, Latif. We have our financial controller, Kelly. We have Makita, hotel administrative assistant. And of course, our amazing guest services manager is Anna. Anna! I know, and we as a team here are so incredibly happy, we're passionate, and we're so proud to have you back with us uh, and hopefully keep you coming back. So anyway, folks, if you do want to come back, make sure you see Christina. She'll help you out. But now I'm going to introduce you to the man that is in charge of it all. A round of applause for the one, the only, Captain Jack! Wonderful and beautiful people, welcome on board the beautiful Adventure of the Seas. I'm your captain, Captain Jared Barry, hailing to you all the way from the snowy east coast of Canada. Glad to be here on Adventure of the Seas with you. And thank you very much. Might I congratulate you on your impeccable taste for choosing Adventure of the Seas and Royal Caribbean Group for your cruise vacation. Thank you very much. Uh, and for you, our, your loyalty, thank you for being loyal to Royal. You are the heart and soul of this company. You keep those propellers spinning. And most importantly, you keep me in a job. Thank you very much. My, my wife thanks you. Someone's got to pay for that, that Amazon bill. You're not done. So on that note, again, I would like to introduce the tallest man on board and uh, the most handsome hotel director in the fleet. We have Francois Chevalier all the way from Quebec, Canada. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and a warm welcome to all of you. My name is Francois Chevalier, and I'm from Montreal, Canada. So that's three Canadians on this ship. I think the company did a big mistake. Um, I've been with the company for um, more than 
than 24 years now. I started uh, in November 1998 on the monarch of the seat out of San Juan, Puerto Rico. Oh. And I want to say a few words about uh, the adventure of the seas because she's full of firsts. She was the first cruise ship to return to the New York Harbor after 9 11. Wow. Yes. So, this is why, thank you, this is why if you go to the Boleros, uh, you're going to see the big picture there. So the grandparents, the godparents of the Adventure of the Seas are the first responders. Uh, so firefighters, uh, police, uh, medics, and their families that responded and helped save life after, during 9-11. And the second first for the Adventure of the Seas is she was the first cruise ship to sail in North America after the pandemic. So we started sailing uh, out of uh, Nassau, Bahamas. Uh, that was in June 2021. And that was before any cruise ship can sail even in the United States. So that was pretty good. So we have uh, seven beautiful days together. I look forward to see you around the ship. And then without any further ado, I want to introduce you someone who is very important and very dear to your heart. And that's because she knows it all. And if she doesn't, she'll find out for you. That is your loyalty ambassador, Corral.
Please, once again, big round of applause for Mr. Pablo Lopez. <laughs> On our first place, we have a guest who has been with the Royal Caribbean for over 25 years. She is from Florida, and her first sailing was a Grand Tour of the Seas in 1998. Her favorite ship is Oasis Class. It's, uh, her favorite port, sorry, is Cape Horn. And with a total of 4,902 points, Mrs. Beth Comfort. She's upstairs as well. Please be grand applause for her. Oh, 
Brilliant. You're going to see her here on stage tonight, shining and shivering. Uh, but now, actually, we have uh, we have to say goodbye for now. I know. Can you believe that? But, 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 I'm meeting you in the very capable hands of our musical director, David, who has a little bit of a surprise, but from each and every one of us here at Royal Caribbean and, of course, for Adventure of the Seas, thank you for coming back. Thank you for joining us. And, oh, 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 I have a Father's Day joke. <laughs> Um, Darth Vader. <laughs> no, I already did the Darth Vader one this morning. But thank you. Um, okay, what what did the father flower say to the sunflower? Hi, bud. <laughs> <laughs> right. Well, the orchestra is getting replaced. <laughs> I'm only kidding, folks. Thank you once again for joining us and coming back. I'm going to leave it now with David, musical director. Thanks, everyone. Yeah. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, I've been with Royal Caribbean 25 years. They just keep forgetting to give me that little pin that you guys get. But, uh, uh, but yes, I've, I've also been, uh, you're not going to believe this, ladies and gentlemen, I'm also a talent scout for the New York Rockettes. And they asked me to find some new talent this morning. So I'm going to do that. So here we go. One, two, three, four. This is my favorite song, Chicago. I love this song.
is blues. All right? When I say the word blues, you take your right foot, you kick to the left, and then you alternate to the end. All right? We could do that, right? If anyone feels like you're going to fall, just hold on to each other. And then if you fall, it'd be like dominoes. All right? So, all right. So let's just move down just a little bit because we got somebody that's probably measuring. All right, that's good. Are they centered, everybody? Are we yeah. ready to go? All right. Remember, blues. This! Is that the correct note, Amy? Oh, not bad. This! Thank you so much, and we'll see you tonight in the show. We are the Adventure of the Seas Orchestra. Ciao, ciao for now.